Join us for an enthralling expedition into the heart of Mesopotamian mythology. Today we're venturing into the mystical stories of the Divine Trinity. Enki, Enlil, and Anu, these deities have etched their names in the annals of time, enchanting generations with their profound narratives. Let's first set the stage with a glimpse into who the Mesopotamians were. Mesopotamia, known as the Cradle of Civilization, was situated in the fertile region between the Tigris and Euphrates rivers, an area that today encompasses modern-day Iraq, Kuwait, and parts of Iran, Syria, and Turkey. This ancient civilization was a melting pot of cultures, where the Sumerians, Akkadians, Babylonians, and Assyrians flourished, each contributing to the rich tapestry of history, culture, and mythology that we explore today. Now let's delve into the extraordinary tales of Enki, Enlil, and Anu, three pivotal gods in Mesopotamian lore, each embodying unique powers and roles that shaped the destinies of gods and mortals alike. Residing in the freshwater abyss of Apsu, Enki was the god of wisdom, water, and creation. His most famous myth involves the Atrahasis, an epic that describes how Enki saved humanity from destruction when Enlil, disturbed by human noise, decided to exterminate mankind with a flood. It was Enki who intervened. He instructed Atrahasis to build an ark, thus preserving life. This story, which predates and likely influenced the biblical tale of Noah's Ark, highlights Enki's role as the protector and benefactor of humanity. Enlil, the lord of air and storms, Enlil ruling from the sky, was revered as the king of the gods and the god of air, wind, and storms. His authority was absolute in maintaining cosmic order. One of the most telling stories of Enlil's power is his decision to send the great flood to earth, a testament to his control over natural forces and divine law. However, it also reveals his capacity for mercy and change. As he eventually agrees to grant eternal life to Utnapishtim, the Sumerian Noah acknowledging the importance of humanity. Anu, the sky god, resided in the highest heavenly realm. His power was considered the greatest among the gods, overseeing the entire cosmos. In Mesopotamian mythology, Anu's most significant act was the division of the heavens and the earth. He delegated the earthly realm to Enlil and the watery abyss to Enki. Establishing the fundamental structure of the cosmos, this division not only demonstrated Anu's authority, but also his role in maintaining balance and order in the universe. The stories of these gods were not mere tales. They were integral to Mesopotamian culture and religion. They provided explanations for natural phenomena, offered moral and ethical guidelines, and helped the Mesopotamians make sense of their world. As we conclude our exploration of Enki, Enlil, and Anu, it's clear that their tales are more than just myths. They are a window into the ancient world. These stories continue to fascinate and inspire, reminding us of the rich heritage of human civilization. Thank you for joining us on this journey into the heart of ancient Mesopotamian mythology. If you enjoyed this exploration, please like, share, and leave your thoughts in the comments below. Until next time, dive deep into the wonders of ancient myths and legends.